Hey YouTube, what is going on? It's Black Tiger here today, guys. And uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to do a uh, bucket list challenges, um, so you can complete any uh, Horizon, I mean Forzathon event. So yeah, if it includes bucket list challenges. But yeah, and this week we've got the uh, Easter um, Forzathon. It's called Basket of Goodies. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so probably the most important event here is. Um, completing five bucket list challenges to win the Porsche 911 GT3 RS 4.0 pretty much the best uh, Porsche engine ever the 4.0 liter is like amazing but uh yeah nonetheless I'll show you guys what you can do to make it really easy to uh find bucket list challenges so what you're gonna do is you go to your world map here and then press LB to change the filter and then uh are you gonna want to do I'll put all back on here, but yeah, just hit all so that erases all of them, and then just scroll down to the bucket list, and then bucket list blueprint, blueprint as well, and then just go back, and it'll show you all the blueprints and bucket list challenges themselves. So yeah, here's one over here. We'll go and do it, and uh, yeah, so I think you have to do five for this challenge. I believe you don't have to like beat them or anything. It's just well, actually no, it says complete them, so I guess you do have to beat them, but. Uh, yeah, you guys, and then the other one, probably the most popular event here would be the complete three matches of King to win three wheel spins as well, but, like, that's, like, the easiest thing ever. You just go online, set up a playground match in, like, the airport, and set it to one minute, do some King events, blah, blah, there you go, three wheel spins for free. But, yeah, something I'm really mad about, though, quickly, is, like, what the heck is this garbage? Apparently the Porsche DLC isn't included in the car pack. Like, what kind of garbage is that? It's not an expansion. It's called a Porsche car pack. I have the car pack. Like, I have the season pass or whatever for the car packs, but apparently I have to pay another $8 for a couple of Porsches. Like, what the heck is this? Like, it's ridiculous. And, like, this isn't even all the Porsches that are coming to the game, I don't think. Like, I think there's more of them that are coming. So, like, this is retarded. I don't know why you have to pay another, like, 10 bucks after tax. And then if they add more Porsches later on, you're going to have to pay another 10 bucks. Like, what kind of garbage is that? So, yeah, I'm kind of mad about that. But, yeah, nonetheless, guys, I'll get back to you once I've uh, finished the fifth bucket list, and we'll see what happens. So, yeah, see you guys in a sec. All right, guys, so we're going to be on our fifth and last Forzathon here. I mean, uh, bucket list event here. So, yeah, all you do when you see the bucket list, like, on the map, you drive up to it, obviously. This is what the signs look like. They're like uh, kind of oval things. I don't know what kind of shape you call that. But uh, yeah, I guess kind of like a oxygen or something. But uh, it's like kind of squished, but whatever. Um, so yeah, you just drive up to it and then press uh, the square button to start it. And uh, yeah, here we go. Hopefully this one won't be too long so I can show you guys uh, me doing it. Uh, blaze through the Outback at high noon in the LaFerrari. All right, let's do it. Hopefully it won't take too long. The last one I just did, so like I had to race like six miles, so it took ages. But uh, oh my god, 4.3 miles! Oh man, I have traction control off and everything. So yeah, I'm gonna have to ship shift up a couple gears here because I'm gonna be spinning out like crazy in low gear. But yeah, it says this is only gonna take one minute, so I guess we're just gonna be going pretty much straight the entire way. So that should be good. Holy smokes, this thing is fast. Holy, it's not even upgraded. That's insane. I should build I should do a tune build of one of these things. Probably be insane dragster. Holy crap, this thing is quick. Holy. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I think I better slow down there probably. It's gonna take some Oh wait, no, I can just like completely cut this corner. Let's see if I can do that. Oh, no, there's a tree right there. Crap. I really should have turned traction control on before I did this. I didn't realize it was going to be this insane. Oh, my God. No, it was probably even worse idea to do this. Probably going to lose, like, a ton of time doing this. Crap, we can't even get back to the road now. Oh, my God, we're totally failing this. Wait, what? What the heck achievement did I just unlock? Crap, we gotta finish this in 15 seconds. I'm not even gonna make it. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, I was so garbage at driving. But I don't have the stupid 
traction control on, so I have, like, no traction. I can't go around these corners. All right, well, I'm gonna retry it, and then I'll be back when I finish it, guys, because I just apparently suck at racing. All right, guys, so I just, uh, completed this thing finally. Holy crap, was this the hardest bucket list I've ever done? That was actually insane. But, uh, yeah, I finally did it. Holy, it was insane. But, uh... Yeah, we'll go take a look at the garage, and I probably guarantee you guys I will not have the car because I haven't bought this retarded DLC yet, which is ridiculous. So, yeah, we'll go take a look nonetheless, I guess, and see if we have it. I know we won't, though, but, uh, yeah, let's go take a quick look here. That was actually an insane bucket list, holy. It's, like, ridiculously hard. But, yeah, let's just change the filter here quickly on the map. There we go, and then we'll fast travel over here real quick and take a look in the garage to see if we have the car, which we will not. But uh, yeah, I guess it's not, uh, won't hurt to try. Yeah, let's take a look here. I pray that it's there. If it's there, it'll actually be sick. We can get one Porsche at least from this uh, new update without having to pay any money, but uh, guarantee you guys we won't have it. Let's go over to P and uh, see if it's there uh, come on where's P at here we go all right we're oh no way we actually get it that's pretty sweet all right so you can get one Porsche without having to buy the DLC that's pretty awesome and this is one of my favorite Porsches too back from Horizon 2 this thing is an absolute beast at drag racing I'm definitely gonna be doing a build on this guy it's probably be my next video Wow, that's actually sick. I'm so happy about that. Alright, well, this Porsche DLC isn't useless after all. Yeah, let's explode this thing. Oh my god, look at that gorgeousness. Oh, let's take a look at this nice Porsche engine. Oh my god, that Boxer engine. Sweet. Boxster. Is it Boxster or Boxer? I'm pretty sure it's Boxer. Wait, no, it's not Boxer. What am I talking about? I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm thinking of Subaru for some reason. But I know Subarus and Porsches have the same style engine, so... Yeah, but wow, look at the interior on it. It's pretty gorgeous as well. Holy, but yeah, let's leave this thing and take it take it for a test drive. Come on, go back. Rev it up for a little bit for you guys here. Oh my god, this is sweet. Awesome. Ooh, it sounds nice. Oh my god, I can't wait to start drag racing this thing. It's already quick too, and I haven't even upgraded it yet. Nice 4.0 liter, sweet. Yeah, if I was ever gonna buy a Porsche, it'd probably be this one, or the older uh, 911 GT3 RS. Sweet. Oh, I shifted way too early there. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and uh, see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.